Twas the night before Chiefsmas, and all through the kingdom, fans were all dreaming about winning the big one. Our jerseys and sweatshirts were laundered with care in hopes that good luck would come with their wear. The refs were all nestled snug in their beds with visions of penalties danced in their heads. And Mama Holtus in her robe and I in Chief's getup were planning the broadcast for the very next matchup. The hour was late and we'd both had some tea, so what happened next could well be a dream. But a noise caught my ear and I jumped out of bed. I looked out the window to see a red sled. It was surrounded by men with helmets and gear. And in the sled seat, a man that would steer. With glasses and mustache and headset on head, I knew in that moment, it must be Big Red. His eyes had a twinkle and a look of great wisdom. He clearly had plans for pleasing the kingdom. But what happened next, I can barely explain, for suddenly on my lawn, a real football game. There were cheers for both sides, fans from both places. This was an arrowhead, but somewhere like Vegas. The anthem was sung and the crowd was at peace. Well, until the end, when most exclaimed, Chiefs. I rubbed my eyes and I rubbed them again. Am I seeing the future? Is this the big game? We won the toss, and they took possession. But they came out strong, got a score, then a second. I started to worry, is this a bad dream? These Chiefs were too good to fall to this team. We scored a few points, but I was still nervous. We've come too far to let this team hurt us. Our defense was fierce and held them from more. But we'd have to hurry if we were to score. The crowd still had faith in a win for our team. In fact, they were louder and starting to scream. The Chiefs were behind in the last quarter, but Big Red was shouting a series of orders. I could barely make out what he had to say, but from what I could hear, it was a trick play. The whistle pierced the air, then play began. I was so anxious, what was the plan? But in a few moments, it all would be clear. A play from now on, we'll call the Reindeer. They both read the same, game and play clocks. The play would depend on some very good blocks. But worries were wasted, as soon you'll see. And we would do more than just put up three. From Creed to Mahomes, then over to Kelsey, then back to Mahomes and Kadarius Toney. Those final few seconds felt like all day. Eight different players touched the ball on this play. Then as timers all fell to zero, Marquez Valdez-Scantling would be our new hero. He lay in the end zone with football in hand. The Chiefs with this victory are champs once again. Suddenly my yard was just a yard with only the sled. And preparing to fly it was a jolly big red. A Chiefs win on Christmas sure would be pretty. Merry Chiefsmas to all. And touchdown, Kansas City!